New Tesla Model S with a staggering 752-mile range has been shown off. As of now, Tesla is selling the Model S with a maximum range of 405 miles. It was temporarily announced that a longer-range Plaid Plus variant with 520-plus miles would be available after battery day. However, that decision was withdrawn and the automobile seemed to be scrapped entirely. While other automakers are delivering vehicles with ridiculously extended ranges that sometimes are handy, Tesla seems to be concentrating on improving efficiency and deploying fast chargers where necessary. Regardless, many prefer greater ranges and the ability to travel for longer periods of time without having to recharge. For instance, we may see that the Lucid Air has a remarkable range of 520 miles, but if Tesla hasn't yet built a vehicle that can go 752 miles, how did this Model S manage to travel more than 700 miles on a single charge? What is the driving force behind this groundbreaker? Let's get the ball rolling. Welcome back to New Vehicle Media, your go-to channel for EV stock. Quick reminder that subscribing's free and liking the video helps YouTube suggest similar content. Comments are loved and featured in upcoming videos. Imagine a 752-mile range for an electric vehicle. Although it's not currently available for purchase, a customized Tesla Model S traveled the whole length of Michigan. A very young, two-year-old Michigan business, our next energy or one, claimed credit for the invention, which it promises would build batteries that are safer and more environmentally friendly. One updated the automobile with a battery that holds twice the amount of energy as the original Tesla battery while still fitting completely within the same space. These batteries serve as the prototype for the company's future battery design. For this experiment, Mujib Ijaz, the founder and CEO of the company, chose a Tesla Model S since it has a relatively good efficiency as well as a suitable battery pack size. Ijaz is a battery engineer with more than 30 years of expertise, having worked for companies such as Apple, A123 Systems, Ford, and others. There are two approaches that EV consumers might take to lessen their range anxiety. The first is widespread, dependable, and countrywide DC fast charging, such as Tesla's supercharger network, which is becoming more popular. Unfortunately, Tesla is the only company that provides this service currently. Every other electric vehicle is reliant on a mishmash of private networks with varied degrees of dependability. The second option is to increase the range of electric vehicles by combining large capacity batteries with improved efficiency. That's the strategy used by the Mercedes-Benz Vision EQXX, a concept electric vehicle that was recently presented and is known for its efficiency. Its objective is to deliver a premium car with a range of 620 miles or more. However, it has yet to be materialized. The One Project did not make any changes to the Model S's performance, but it did make use of a considerably larger battery with a substantially greater capacity. The business hopes to speed the adoption of electric vehicles by removing range anxiety, which is now a barrier for customers. One installed its higher capacity prototype battery pack into a Tesla Model S Long Range Plus, which provided roughly 90% greater range than the vehicle's initial 402 mile EPA rating. The original Tesla battery had a capacity of 103.9 kilowatt hours. However, the prototype one battery that replaced it in the same area had a capacity of 207.3 kilowatt hours. As a result, it is much more rich in energy, yet its energy consumption in miles per kilowatt hour is nearly equivalent to that of the original battery. In the middle of December, one's journey took place in Michigan, when the cold winter weather was pushing against maximizing range. Before arriving back at its Novi offices in southwestern Michigan with 752.2 miles on the trip odometer, the upgraded EV traveled up and down the length of the state at an average speed of 55 miles per hour for about 14 hours. 
An even more casual test was conducted afterwards in which Tesla drove its Model S for an incredible 882 miles on a single charge while traveling steadily at 55 miles per hour on a dynamometer. That is one staggering number. The prototype developed by the firm is referred to as a proof of concept. In this experiment, the goal was to determine that in the near future, real-world ranges that are significantly greater than a typical driver's stamina will be possible. In the following stage, this technology will be transformed into a new battery known as Gemini, which is expected to enter manufacturing around 2023. One claims to be focused on battery chemistries that are safer and sustainable, as well as a conflict-free supply chain. Specifically, the business wants to complement the lower-cost LFP cells with a range extender component of the battery for high power demands in order to avoid stress and degradation in the majority of cells. A redesigned anode with no graphite will be used in range extender cells, according to the business, which makes more space accessible for the cathode, allowing the energy density of a range extender cell to be increased significantly. The cathode will be composed of a patented manganese-rich substance that, according to one, can be obtained at a cheap cost via sustainable sourcing. To date, the company's Gemini pack has been the subject of 14 patent applications by the business. The LFP cells are responsible for 99% of the vehicle's duty cycle, with the range extender only being utilized for the remaining 1%. But the prototype pack that was utilized in the experiment was powered by a different sort of cell. High-energy cobalt-nickel cells gave more than 200 kilowatt hours of capacity whereas the cobalt-nickel cells meant for the Gemini line are still in the early stages of research. The purpose of this test, in other words, was not to learn about one's future intentions for developing additional cells. Instead, it was intended to demonstrate that it is feasible to pack far more energy into a battery that is the same size as today's without, for instance, double-stacking a pair of packs as General Motors is doing for the GMC Hummer EV. Concerned purchasers might take comfort in hearing that the 2022 Lucid Air version will have a range of 520 miles, or the EQXX's stated goal of 620 miles, as well as the 752-mile range of the prototype. People will begin to think that electric vehicles with very long ranges are possible even if they ultimately go for a more economical 300-mile option. For the time being, the industry's solution to the range problem has been to increase the number of charging stations. However, relying on fast charge stations comes with its own set of challenges, including lengthy wait times, charging that is not as quick as stated, and being restricted to a partial charge, which necessitates stopping every 150 miles. One has built its solution the Gemini TM battery to completely prevent this scenario by providing adequate range for every user to use an electric car as their only mode of transportation. Because the firm has provided a viable answer and filled a market need, it is possible that investors will be interested in investing in the company. However, the firm does not yet trade on the stock market, but it has been seeking funds from venture capitalists in order to support its commercial expansion. Given the potential of the firm, there is little question that the company will go public in the near future or perhaps another SPAC merger. Many people will consider it a good contender to add to their portfolio. While discussing portfolios in stocks, Rivian stock has taken a beating lately because of unfavorable news and a rise in traditional automakers' market dominance. Alpha Hydro says that Rivian still has a lockup expiry in May that it will have to deal with. He intends to wait for the correction and then purchase the dip when it strikes. That should wrap things up for today. Keep in mind that subscribing is still free and liking helps you to recognize your preferences. Thanks for taking the time to watch and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.